News, a Union County woman found dead at Chicago's O'Hare International Airport. Her body caught up in some baggage machinery. Good evening. Thanks for joining us live at five. I'm Siobhan Bryan and I'm Jamie Bolt. A really sad story. We first broke it to you late this afternoon. We're told it happened early yesterday morning at O'Hare, one of the world's busiest airports. Investigators say workers found 57 year old Virginia Vinton from Waxhaw dead in a conveyor belt system in a baggage room. And as our Jason Puckett reports, authorities didn't find the woman's body for almost five hours. The story is all new, live at five. Paramedics and police swarmed the outside of Terminal 5 just after 7.30 Thursday morning after reports of an unresponsive woman found in the baggage handling area. That area is filled with conveyor belts bringing luggage to and from airplanes in the International Terminal. Those bags also go through customs inspection. The area is restricted to employees, though it is not considered high security. When paramedics arrived there, there was little they could do. O'Hare just requested an ET. Um... Long story short, uh, they had someone try to go up the bag conveyor belt and they got stuck and uh, entangled themselves in their DOA now. Police now say they have video from security cameras in the airport showing the 57-year-old woman entering the restricted area at about 2.27 Thursday morning. Employees did not discover her, however, until about 7.30 when she was found unresponsive, tangled up in the conveyor belt. Police have not said whether they've been able to track the woman's activities between 2.30 and 7.30 at this point. They now say they are performing a death investigation. Jason Puckett, WBTV, on your side.